right here we have the UH-1B and this is a rescue helicopter and it was used for like the the army people who got injured or so if it was getting attacked it had a minigun and follow rocket and we have an example a really really good example of the rocket we had a uh 2.75 inch a uh, rocket or 70 meter uh, millimeter rocket and then we had a uh, 7.62 uh metamination so like this is what they use for the minigun and these are the rockets that's a really good example to show it plus it's really safe Whoa, it's really cool. So if you look inside, we have miniguns and follow rockets also. We have uh, over there, we have where the, pa the patients or the army, the injured army person can lay down over there. And then we have the cockpit over here where the two flyers can sit there and fire extinguisher obviously. And the same thing over here, minigun and rockets. Let's continue. Right here, we have the CH-54B, the Sky Crane, Sky Crane. This is a really, really big airplane, I mean helicopter. This is, was also used in our army. This, the, like the wings, the blades are really, really humongous. Yeah, you want, and the cool thing about this helicopter is, you wanna know why it's? You want to know? Yeah. You can go inside of it. Oh. Yeah, we can go inside of it. Let's go. We have over here the wheels, and we have a bench. Whoa, this is so cool. This is where the army people, the military gets inside. Oh my goodness. I feel so cool. And the army people had to sit over here until it was their turn to go. Yeah, and they should relax. And yeah. And then we have TVs here to news. Well, it's really cool. Yeah, I it's so it's so echoing here. Pop up, pop up, pop up. We have the exit, let's go. There's so much fun. Oh, that's scary, eyes. Oh, look over here. We have some pictures of it when it was actually on the ground without the pit. You want to see him? Yeah. So that's what this um the UH uh 54B looked like.